what's up everyone i'm kind of doing an unusual food review uh, let me preface this by saying that i don't drink um, let me also say that i'm a christian but with that said i'm not judging anybody that drinks and i'm not saying that christians can't drink nowhere in the bible does it say that christians cannot have a drink it just is clear about not getting drunk so it's just my personal preference that i don't drink i'm not judging any of you that do um, it's just not my thing uh, so let your convictions be your own um, and yeah so God bless all of you that's all I got to say um, I'm just here to spread the love of Jesus I want to review this because uh, I'm just a big Mountain Dew fan so hard Mountain Dew yeah so I am going to review this for you uh, I'm just kind of interested in it uh, so this does contain alcohol this is Mountain Dew Baja Blast Zero Sugar. It's got a shark on it, so I thought I better wear my Mountain Dew Shark shirt. So let's get a really cool thumbnail right there. All right, here we go. I'm going to crack this thing open. All right, let's take a smell of this. Definitely can smell the alcohol in there. So yeah, let's... uh take a sip of this kind of excited about it hmm it's very interesting so I do taste the alcohol but I can still taste Mountain Dew in that um, yeah you can still taste the Baja Blast but obviously it's got a little bit of a different flavor malt beverage with natural flavors artificial sweetener certified color and FDNC oh, yellow number five that's all the ingredients um, so yeah I don't really know I'm not a big alcohol fan so I can't really compare it to anything um, but Baja Blast it's kind of got that tropical um, Mexican flavor, so it's a little bit like a margarita, but sweeter in a way. So, yeah, that's kind of what I get from it. <clears throat> it's still really refreshing. I think they probably put a little more alcohol in there than they could have just because I want to taste more of the Mountain Dew, but I don't know. Maybe it's a good mix. It's just hard to compare since. I don't usually have this kind of drink. It tastes really good. Um, it's not an overpowering alcohol to where it just kind of makes you grimace when you drink it or anything. It's not like a whiskey or anything like that. Um, like I said, it's more like a margarita. It's not overpowering. I just kind of wish maybe it had more Mountain Dew flavor. So it's not like you take a drink and it's just really hard to get in one sip or anything. No, it's nothing like that. It's got a good flavor. You know, I can't say I like it as good as regular Mountain Dew. Um, just because it's not my cup of tea, no pun intended. Um, but yeah. And even though it's sweet, um, like I want more Mountain Dew sweet, not like a malt sweet. I want more soda sweet. Um, maybe if it was regular um, and had sugar. I don't know. That's just my opinion. I don't think the alcohol has that bad of a taste, if I'm just being honest. In my opinion, um, you might not like it. I'll give it a 3 out of 5. I just want more of the Baja Blast flavor. It doesn't have enough. Not that I'm condemning alcohol here. I just want more Baja Blast flavor. I can't give it a perfect score, just because it's not my favorite drink in the world. But it does have a good flavor, and uh, it's a good malt beverage, and uh, still has... A touch of that Mountain Dew flavor in there. So Baja Blast is one of my favorite Mountain Dews. Probably third after Code Red and the original. So yeah. I've got another flavor. I won't tell you what it is right now. I'll let that be a surprise. But as always, if there's anything you'd like for me to review, leave it in the comment section below. I'll get to it. Check you later. God bless. Music